Boise State picked up a hard-fought win over UNLV late on Friday night. I'm sports reporter Steve Dent. Here's a look at how they did it, what they were up against, with reaction from the team. Boise State would be without Emmanuel Acott once again, and they would have to deal with Bryce Hamilton as UNLV jumped out to a 13-4 lead behind this prolific score. Mladen Armouche hasn't played well lately, but he sparked BSU in the first half as they rallied to tie it up at 20. Armouche scored 12 points and was one of four Broncos in double figures. He's such a big part of our team, and we just need him down these stretches. And you know, We call him the beast for a reason, and he showed it today. But Hamilton would respond. He had 18 points in the first half, and UNLV would take a seven-point lead into halftime. Hamilton, holy cow. You know. I mean, he starts out three for three from three, and one of them is a four, and and you're like, this guy is never going to miss, and and you know we just kept throwing different things at him to to try to break his rhythm. Coach Rice came out in a zone to start the second half, and it worked. Boise State would start the half on a 6-0 run, cutting the deficit to one with this bucket by a Buki jab. Meanwhile, Hamilton would pick up two quick offensive fouls and would go to the bench. Boise State took their first lead of the game and then stretched it to four on this three-pointer by Marcus Shaver Jr. He scored 13 in the game. Then a BSU staple. Kijab hustles for a loose ball, gets it to Shaver, who threads a perfect bounce pass to Tyson Dagenhart for the easy lay-in. That was a great pass. But then Hamilton would come back into the game and the teams would go back and forth the rest of the way. Here, Max Rice finds Dagenhart. The freshman scored 15 in the game, and this three gave BSU a five-point lead with 7-14 to play. But the running Rebels would not go away, and this three-pointer in transition would pull UNLV within one with 2.09 to play. Next possession for the Broncos. Armouche goes for the slam, doesn't get it, but he draws the foul and hits two clutch free throws. <laughs> But here comes that man again, Hamilton, on the next possession to pull it back within one. He scored 32 in the game. But then, key jab, cannonball, huge splash, biggest shot of the game. Key jab led the way with 18. Broncos would make their free throws and earn a gutty, gutty win. Because we are a team. 69-63 over UNLV. Big buckets down the stretch. You know, I'm so proud of him because... Our backs were against the wall, you know, we weren't making some threes and that kind of stuff. And we did the things that we need to do down the stretch. And that's the that's the trademark of this team. It doesn't get any easier for Boise State as they host Colorado State on Sunday with a two o'clock tip. Steve Dent, Idaho News 6.